Hey there, welcome to The Untidy Artist. Today we will be making a beaded sparkle headband. These headbands are simple to make, require no sewing, and are actually one of my favorite new hair accessories to wear in my own hair. Let's gather our supplies. You will need some seed beads, some E6000 industrial strength adhesive, a headband, a piece of felt, some sharp scissors, a ruler, my trusty glue gun set on low, and a toothpick which is not shown. The first thing we're going to do is cut a base for our headband out of the felt. Cut a rectangle out of the felt that measures three and a half inches by one and three quarters inch, and then even it up a bit and round off the corners. Once you have your base cut, take your felt and lay it on a flat surface and use your glue to outline the very outer edge of your felt and then fill in the middle with an ample amount of your glue. You want to saturate the felt with it. And then take your toothpick and you're going to evenly distribute the glue all over your piece of felt, paying special attention to the edges to make sure that the glue goes all the way to the edge. Now take your seed beads and start to sprinkle them over the glue. You want to make sure that you cover all of the felt. Now gently press the beads into the felt, making sure that all of the felt is covered and if you need to go back and sprinkle more beads, go ahead and do that and just keep pressing until the felt is entirely covered. So you can see I'm just going back here now and kind of filling in spots that might need a few more beads. Now take your excess beads, pour them back into your container, and make sure that you let the glue set for a few hours or even overnight. Figure out where you'd like your beads to sit on the headband. Cut a piece of felt that's just smaller than the base of your headband. This will go on the back. And then take some glue, line it up, and I kind of just tack it into place and hold it for a minute on the one side. And once that sets, tack it on the other side and just hold it into place and then we're going to secure it by taking our other piece of felt that's just going to line the back and hold it into place. As you can see the piece of felt we're applying to the back of the headband is just smaller than the front and it just holds the headband nicely into place so press it firmly and once it's dried here is your finished project. You can also use this same technique to make beaded sparkle clips. These are a lot of fun as well. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comments below. You can show your support by subscribing to The Untidy Artist. Make sure you thumbs up if you liked this tutorial. Uh, also, I post tutorials on Tuesdays and Thursdays and check out my Facebook page. We do giveaways on Fridays. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.